How's it going guys, it's Root Junkie here and in today's video we're going to show you how to factory reset protection bypass the Nexus 6P on Android and developer preview. Yeah, this is going to be a good one. Alright, let me show you how this is going to work. So, I'm on the preview right now and um, I'm going to show it to you once I get going but uh, we're going to go ahead and skip my sim, I don't have a sim in it. So we got right here, we've got the network connections. And just click on one that you're not connected to. You don't have to be connected at this point. It really doesn't matter. And we're going to just bring up our keyboard. We're going to go into settings of the keyboard. Go to keyboard settings. We're going to go to text correction. Personal dictionary. We're going to come up here. And I think it's under feedback. There we go. And then we're going to come up here and we're going to go to print. And then in print, we're going to come up here and go to all printers. Then we're going to come up here and go to cloud print. And then we're going to hit nothing. And then we're going to go to feedback. Yeah, I know. It's kind of a lot. You're going to have to just flow with it. And then we're going to go to open policies. So we're going to hold down anywhere on, on here. And then we're going to hit share. Yeah, yeah. It's <laughs> pretty cool, right? Then we're going to go to Gmail. Actually, I don't want to go to Gmail. Let's do it again. We're going to hit share. We're going to hold down on Gmail. We're going to go to App Info. We're going to go to uh, Notifications. You're going to click the little Settings thing. You're going to come up here and you're going to hit Manage Account. You're going to hit Continue. And shabam, Android N. You are at it right there. You can see it. Android N. Oh, yeah. There it is. You're in Settings. Now, I think the build number should be blocked. Let's see. Yeah, you can't, you can't turn on Developer Options. But what you can do is you can come up here to backup and reset wipe data factory reset you can say I don't even have like an account in here because um, I just don't and then you hit reset phone erase everything and ba -ba -ba -ba, you did it you wipe data factory reset Android N factory set protection is now wiped off the device and you should be able to set up totally normal like you would a brand new device and yeah so then you can then once you've got that you can you know turn on developer options you can do all your stuff normal setup unlock the bootloader if you want whatever you want to do from there um yeah so cloud print is your friend yes cloud print i shake hands with you i love cloud print yay anyway i uh, yeah i just had to show you guys this now is this going to be patched before Android N comes out officially? Yes, I think it probably will. But I just had to show you because I thought it was awesome. Hope you guys enjoy. Stay tuned for more videos. Oh, since you see it, it freezes on first boot after you wipe data factory set and boots again, and then you boot up fine. So it's already done this. I've wiped it so many times that it does it every time. So again, probably a bug with Android N. But yeah, I hope you guys love this videos. Stay tuned, I'm going to keep doing research on factory set protection because I think it's fun. And uh, we'll catch you guys in the next one. Rude Junkie, out.